What's up, internet? It's the Jerry Crew, yeah. Recently, I made the mistake of looking on my Facebook feed. It's always the kind That's mistake. a mistake. Yes. And I found this. <laughs> and I showed Cassidy, and we weren't really sure we didn't what, what to do with it. The only logical explanation is to make a YouTube video about it. Disclaimer before we get into this. We don't give a fuck about your political views. You think I care? I mean, you guys are welcome to have a war in the comments just because- Yes, um, we like looking at people um, argue. I like to think of like Donald Trump sitting down and being like, okay, I'm gonna write some like good old fashioned poetry. Well, so we're gonna find we're out. We're about to find out if he is. The first poem. I hope you all enjoy it. It's called, I'm Really Rich. I'm very proud of my new crystal collection. I have a Gucci store that's worth more than Romney. I order thousands of televisions a year. Six people do nothing but sort my mail. Sorry, haters and losers. He who has the gold makes the rules. I don't know how to snap, but if I did, ooh, I'd be snapping. I am the least racist person there is. I've always had a great relationship with the blacks. I remain strong for Tiger Woods during his difficult period. Oprah, I love Oprah. Oprah can do anything! Oprah would always be my first choice. Kanye West, I love him. I think Eminem is fantastic and most people think I don't like Eminem. And uh, I know. And did you know my name is in more black songs than any other name in hip hop? You are the racist, not I. This is one called Everybody Loves Me. I feel like these are like like bedtime stories. It's like how to raise little narcissists. Everyone loves you, little <laughs> Billy. Tom Brady loves me. The people of New York, they love me. Upstate New York, I'm like the most popular person that ever lived. The bikers love me. You know who loves me? The tea party. The evangelicals. Yes. My children could not love me more if I spent 15 times more time with them. The vets love me. The African Americans love me. The Asians love me. Many Hispanics who love me. Most conservatives love me. Society loves me. You are going to love me, or I will spill the beans on your wife. <laughs> what did the wife do? And here's another one that I feel like is very emotionally important to Donald I feel Trump. like this is very important. My hands are normal hands. I buy a slightly smaller than large glove. The five fingers represent the five key factors of every entrepreneur dreaming of success must so, so this is a poem that I like to call what's going on what's going on it's twice I swear to God does my family like me where are the women why is this reporter touching me as I leave news conference what is in her hand I don't know which microphones to hold. My hair, should I change it? I'm sort of like, what am I doing? I don't wanna be president. I'm 100% sure. Let's read the next one, please. I am the best. Yes. I predicted Apple's stock would fall. I will build a great, great wall. I build buildings <laughs> that are 94 stories tall. My hands, are they small? When he starts th talking about buildings, all I can kind of think of is this. Hey, Elmo, Zoe, stop! Hey, did you hear me? I said stop! No! I'm gonna explain. We literally just wanted to find some excuse to put that in this video. Um, it's called Hot Little Girl in High School. And it goes a little something like this. I'm a very compassionate person with a very high IQ. Just think, 
In a couple of years, I'll be dating you. It must be a pretty picture. You dropping to your knees? Come here. I'll show you how life works. Please. There's a book called Goodnight Trump. If you'd like to purchase it, it's only uh, $4.98. Good for the kids. I just want to read about Donald Trump. Do I have to buy this book? Do I have to buy this book? Because I will. We can't find any more for free online. So for this channel, I'm literally buying this book. Please. Please, Please subscribe. Please subscribe. <laughs> I can't stress that enough. Daddy Trump, will you read me your poetry to Betty Bye, please? Mom, please guys, if you see me on the streets, don't beat me up. What do you mean, invalid code? I'm gonna fuck your mother! If they really don't want me to read this book to the internet. You always want what you can't have, kids. I think Jesus okay. is descending upon us. <laughs> I'd like to announce that we have just wholly, in a holy fashion, have bought this book. <laughs> I think that we're gonna be raptured. Okay, the title of it is This Country is Going to Hell in a Handbasket. It just seems that our country is not what it used to be. New York Fashion Week is really bad and used to be so glamorous and exciting. Vanity Fair magazine, which used to be one of my favorites, is failing badly. A lot of people are switching to these really long putters. Very unattractive. Our poor, poor country. I apologize ahead of time. Uh, this is called Barack Hussein Obama. A haiku. Who you think? The worst ever president. Founder of ISIS. I am the most fabulous whiner. I own the largest winery on the- <laughs> I own the largest winery on the East Coast I do wine. We make the finest wine because I want to win. And I'm not happy about not winning. I am a whiner. Many different kinds of wines. And I am a whiner and I keep whining and whining <laughs> until I win. But Jesus descended on us again. He knows we need help. And I'm going to win. This is one just titled, I won. It says, well, we've had some disasters, but this is the worst. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Okay. This one's called, We are going to have to get rid of them. Weasels are hard to get rid of. They don't wear uniforms. They're sneaky, dirty rats. It's been 18 months of brutality in a true sense, but we won. Trump Grill just received the highest sanitary inspection grade possible. This, this is called Crooked Hillary. <laughs> Haiku. She got schlonged. She lost. A nasty horrid woman. Time to drain the swamp. This one's called Bad Hombres. I've known some bad dudes. I've been at parties. They want to do serious harm. I've seen and I've watched things like with guns. I know a lot of tough guys, but they're not smart. We're dealing with people that are animals, but they are the folks I like best by far. <laughs> this one's called President Putin, a haiku. Is a strong leader, said Trump is a genius. Highly respected. What a, what a man. All I ask is fairness. People are constantly attacking my hair. I think it's very unfair. Obama said he never met his uncle Oscar. Imagine if I made that statement, it would be the electric chair. What? Okay, this is a this is a, 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 a poem uh, titled "These People Are Losers." Jeb Bush is a low energy stiff. Rosie O'Donnell's disgusting, both inside and out. Carly Fiorina is terrible at business. Sacha Baron Cohen is a moron. John Stewart is a joke, not very bright and totally overrated. Cher is somewhat of a loser. Lord Sugar, you're a total loser, who Piers Morgan doesn't think is very smart or very rich. These people are losers. Think the real Lord that Donald Trump exists. Goofy Elizabeth Warren. <laughs> oh, stop. A haiku. Has a nasty mouth. We call her Pocahontas. 
I say she's a fraud. This one's called I respect women, I love women, I cherish women. Uh, and it just says vagina is expensive. No more apologies. Take the offensive. Oh, come on, Kate. Everyone knows women aren't people. This one's called look at this baby. That is a great, beautiful baby. It's young and beautiful and healthy. I love babies. What a baby. What a beautiful baby. Okay, that's enough. You can get the baby out of here. I like kids. I won't do anything to take care of them. They're ugly, little, and don't work. Slowly the hair dries. It's a process that can take 18 months to two years. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. This one's called I am open-minded. I use both iPhone and Samsung. A great leader has to be flexible. Very dishonest media. The BBC is in total disarray. The failing New York Times gets worse and worse by the day. The leaks are absolutely real. The news is fake. I'm turning to Fox News where we get a fair shake. Watch Saturday Night Live hit job on me. I don't call it thin-skinned. I'm angry. This is a little one I like to call, does torture work? Listen, you motherfuckers. Not everything is nice. Waterboarding, sleep deprivation, me singing call me maybe. I'm not saying it's pleasant, but believe me, it works. We've got to stop the stupid. Oh, do we? You know what uranium is, right? It's a thing called nuclear weapons and other things like lots of things that are done with uranium, including some bad things. I have to explain to these people, they don't understand basic physics, basic mathematics, whatever you want to call it. I mean, they're like stupid. Someone give them the Nobel Prize. This one's called, get the oil, get the oil, get the oil. I would take the oil. I know, it's crude. I don't know what that means. This is one called pervert alert. Got to do something about these missing children grabbed by the pervert. Hashtag angels. I own a couple of different guns. I could stand in the middle of Fifth Avenue and shoot somebody. Boom, boom, boom. Death to the pervert killer. It makes me feel so good to hit sleaze bags back. Much better than seeing a psychiatrist, which I never have. Women have one of the great acts of all time. The smart ones act very feminine and needy but inside they are real killers. I wouldn't mind if there were an anti-Viagra. That's the kind of thinking our country needs right now. Okay. Uh, here's something called, there's something going on that we don't know about. There is a colonial woman on the wing. It's a woman on the wing. I saw her, there is something they're not telling us. A lot of people are saying that bad things are happening out there. A lot of people are talking about it. I'm not saying that and I'm not, a conspiracy person. I'm not going to say it because I'm not allowed to say it because I want to be politically correct. I know nothing about it. People truly get what's going on. I don't know what that means. Good genes. All men are created equal. Well, it's not true. Some are smart, some aren't. Do we believe in the gene thing? I mean, I do. I'm blessed with good genes. Good, great brain. Good sized hands. German blood. We have people that are stupid. They cannot help the fact that they were born fucked up. Slow horses don't produce fast horses. Uh, this is one called Very Foul Mouthed Senator John McCain. Graduated last. Doesn't know how to win. Not a war hero. Um, that's enough for today. Anyway, if you like what you saw, please click like and subscribe. Subscribe to see more of whatever the heck this was. Um, yes, please. I just dropped eight dollars on this poetry book, um, with my own fucking money. If you don't subscribe, you're gonna make her really sad. Yeah. Bye! Bye.